Okay, my Mary Jane lovers. <laughs> okay, what's up, stoners? I'm a stoner, I'm a stoner, I'm a stoner. Okay, I don't know why. I This is definitely going to be very different, but for my stoners, this message is for you. Okay, go on and roll your one. Tap in. Today, I am resourceful. Today, I will turn anything into opportunity. Okay, so anything could be an opportunity. Anything could turn into an opportunity. Once you hit that Mary Jane. <laughs> Today, I am grateful for Mary Jane. <laughs> Today, my heart is filled with joy. I will see the positive in everything. And you're able to do that when you escape this motherfucking 3D. Okay, just so we're clear. You ain't never heard of a motherfucker getting high off of weed and killing someone. Killing themselves. Harming something. Like, it, it doesn't. It just doesn't. That That's not... People aren't addicted to marijuana. They can stop at any time. You know, they just choose to keep everyone alive, to stay sane, and to fucking smoke. So if you're not a stoner and you're here, you know, just take a fucking load off, okay? Today, I am powerful. Today, my potential to succeed and conquer challenges is limitless. These are affirmations, guys. Say these aloud. Today, I will not give in. Today, I will not allow negative thoughts or feelings to prevent me from achieving happiness. Getting motherfucking stoned and letting the rest of that shit fly. This is why motherfuckers stay smoking, okay? Just for the stoners, we understand. I understand you. Okay, for those non-smokers, please understand this. This is keeping humanity balanced. <laughs> this is how somebody really feels. Okay, I'm not the fucking only... I'm getting this message. This is literally a message. Okay, weed is from the earth. It is not some shit cooked up in a fucking pharmaceutical company or in someone's goddamn house. Hey, let's just be a, a friendly reminder. This shit cures cancer. This shit helps people. Like, and I'm literally going to put stoner, okay? Because that song just tickles the fuck out of me. Okay. So, that's the name of the motherfucking reading. Okay. Disclosure, I understand that, you know, some people got to be very discreet with their shit. So you may not be able to like this motherfucker. But if you ain't got nothing, you know, holding you back and you a stoner like this bitch. Even if not, it is still going to show through the numbers, okay? Nobody can tell who are viewing the video. So you slick good. But I still, you know, I wanted to give this. This is just like something completely different. I don't know if anyone else has ever done like a stoner reading, but I definitely wanted to. That fucking song, I'm telling you, just tickled the fucking shit out of me. All right, what does my stoners need to know? Spirit guides, ancestors of the highest white light, please give us clear and accurate messages. Okay, those that are stoners. I'm a stoner, I'm a stoner, I'm a stoner. I'm getting all type of music for y'all. 420 on the clock, okay? <laughs> Release your ex. The time has come to clear your energy. To clear your mind from the bullshit. Exhale the bullshit and inhale the good shit. Okay? Somebody could be looking at a paper, looking at something. You could be like overwhelmed with work and you're like, fuck it out. I, I gotta go. I gotta smoke. You know, I, I just need to take a moment, okay? <laughs> Free yourself. The time to take back control of your life. Okay? Freeing yourself from this ex that you were dealing with. Your ex could have been this stoner. Take it however. Okay? Wedding. Okay. This situation involves a marriage here. So something I'm going to discuss involves a marriage. Freeing yourself. This could be from this marriage. Someone could be married and they're needing to release their ex. 
okay? Any of these people could be stoners. You could be here for this, okay? Clear and accurate messages on release your ex. Ooh. Okay, this says your love life benefits as you forgive your parents. So forgiving your parents for any sort of trauma that you may be holding on to in order to help you gain back control over your life. Poverty, main female. So the main female may need money here. Oh, somebody that they have a child with that is their ex. They could have been in poverty because they were giving to this person. I'm seeing kids here. That would be someone who mainly stays around. Okay. Take it however it resonates, guys. Okay. If there could be some films with their pockets fucked up. It's time to take back control. Go chase the back, sis. You're resourceful. Okay. Free yourself. Clarity on free yourself, please. Now, also, like, I'm getting somebody's in the background saying, but you're not supposed to be smoking either. You're supposed to be sober and vigilant. Okay, that's not methamphetamines that is going inside of someone's body. Okay, so let's just please take that into consideration. Um, I don't really know as far as, I mean, I look at it personally. My personal opinion, it is from the fucking earth. It is a herb and it is from the earth. I don't give a fuck if you smoke. When you start doing dope, meth, crack, all that shit, that's, that's when the fucking issues come. That's chemicals. That's fucking with your brain. Weed has a different chemical reaction than methamphetamine to a human body, to your vessel. So, I mean, some people could have different looks on that. You know, someone could be saying that this female is in poverty because... You know, she needs to take back control of her life because she smokes. You know, that could be something else that I'm getting here. I don't know. But let's see. I mean, if somebody... I mean, I don't know. Because, I mean, I, I'm picking up... Look, courthouse. So, somebody could be going to court. Yeah, a message of concern, wealthy man. So someone taking someone that you're married to to court. Oh, and because they didn't release their ex, now they about to be in poverty because this female about to get the money. Shut the fuck up. High honor. Great fortune. Either way it go, it's motherfucking whole lot of money in this motherfucker. <laughs> okay, so some there could be a masculine that's going to court. I said somebody is looking at a paper here, and this motherfucker is like, okay, I gotta go to court for something. Oh, look, looking at the paper. Oh, Lord. I gotta go to fucking court. Possibly have to spend money. So this female could be granted money. High honor is going to come in with money. Fem films, if you're left out, you're feeling like you're in poverty, you don't have money, know that you are resourceful. You can turn anything into an opportunity. Look at everything in a positive perspective. You can conquer all challenges here. Maybe somebody don't have the resources to smoke, but they need to where they want to. I don't know. I don't fucking know. Whatever. Do not allow negative thoughts or feelings to prevent you from achieving happiness. 
let's get more. Work on your partnership. Give your relationship a chance. Unexpected income is coming here. So I feel like once you work on something, it's going to be like hella money coming to your path. Like your pathway is going to be overflowing here. But I don't know what exactly... Listen, sudden wealth. I'm telling you, somebody is this fucking masculine is either getting money or this motherfucker paying money. Deceptions and endings. Yep. This motherfucker gotta pay money because this marriage is coming to an end because of deception. Hello, money. <laughs> Heard it. This motherfucker is in despair. I cannot. Alimony is all I hear. Okay. Because I swear to God, I've been thinking about this shit with my husband. Like, nigga, you want me to stay your wife for two years and be separated for absolutely no reason? Well, motherfucker, I done did everything. I done tried to give you the easy way. So I guess you want the hard way. Let's go on and hit that alimony. So if you've been thinking about hitting some motherfucking alimony, Go get that shit. Especially if you got physical, hardcore fucking proof. Get your shit. That's what the motherfucking paperwork is. That's what these paperwork is. Okay? That's all this paper. Go on and turn all that shit in. Somebody, I didn't even want to go that far. So somebody may not have really even wanted to go that far. But it's, it's here. Okay? So this is what the fuck we got going on. Okay. So let's see. Spirit guys, ancestors of the highest white light, please give me clear and accurate messages. Or I feel like once you release this X here, then you guys are going to get married. No, nah, somebody shit ending, bro, because of it. No, that is it's the first one. I was about to say it's it's like as soon as somebody get married, they get hella fucking opportunities here. But something has come to an end because of this deception. Okay, so give me clarity on this. Look, stay at home, baby. Listen, stay at home, mom. The female is in poverty. Okay. Let's see. Let's get more clarity on this. Just a little bit longer. Whatever this headache is. Spirit said just a little bit longer. Something is a headache for you. But just a little bit longer and your great fortune is coming. This money is coming to you. It is in your direct path. Between the 27th and the 30th, I'm seeing sevens and twos. Then we got threes and fives here. Okay, so between the 2nd and the 27th, maybe next month or so. I don't know. Let's see, honey. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Please and thank you for this message. Okay. Please give me clear and accurate messages, ancestors of the highest one. Like, wanting to escape some poor decisions, family cursed. I feel cursed to have you in my life, a destructive ass person. Leave them because they're cheating. Exactly like I'm on the fucking thing. Truth revealed. <laughs> You are being guided. You were selected to be chosen. So you're a chosen one here. Okay. Someone lacked communication or someone was a woman beater. 
So definitely, if a motherfucker was putting their hands on you and you got girl. Mm -mm. Look, pull all the motherfucking rabbits out the hat. All right. Order is being established. Pull all the motherfucking rabbits out of the hat. Fuck how you feel. This is what I'm hearing right now. Because I'm even the compassionate one as well. Fuck what you hearing. Pull all of your motherfucking strings. Every goddamn string that you have, pull that shit. Okay? True shit. No cap. No bullshit. <laughs> Look, a male, karmic, lying motherfucker, someone who's avoiding this, lack of accountability, you see it. I'm not making this up. <laughs> it's here in front of you. Nothing is out of reach for you. Because you are powerful, remain grateful here. You have a beautiful soul and a beautiful smile. And you will also have a peaceful home. Continue to love yourself. Yeah. So reflecting. This is some shit that you usually don't do. But look. As you're doing this. As you're tapping into your root chakra. Then dreams are coming true. Success. Fame. Prosperity. Happiness. You're going to realize what your dream is. You just need solitude, time to contemplate, doing things that you don't usually do, stepping out of the box. Please give me clear and accurate messages. Okay. Be sure to laugh daily. Okay, somebody got their own shit, their own house, their own car, their own fucking everything, okay? Like, be grateful for that. Thank you, Spirit, for our home, the roof that is over my head, my family's head, as well as my viewers, okay? Even if they do not express gratitude, I express that for them. We are so very thankful for your constant peace, for your constant protection, for your constant guidance. age gap relationship so there is an age difference like me i'm 31 my husband is 42 it could be something big like that or it could be something smaller you know small business owner you are being protected From the sneakiness, from whatever the backstabbing bullshit is. Don't worry about money. Happily married. Don't worry about money. Don't worry about being happily married. Don't worry about the foolishness. You will have someone that you can be vulnerable, vulnerable with who will check on your mental health and who will give you both room to be yourself and show you appreciation and someone that you will be able to speak your mind with and play it safe. Yeah, that's the truth. Mental breakthrough. Getting clarity. Panties, a dope head. So you may have found some panties and it was from a dope head. Yeah, somebody's creating memories with a gold digger. Yeah, and they thought they were doing something, but no. Okay. So, whatever, whatever tacky shit this is. Yeah. 
You could have an unhappy family. You guys could have canceled plans or something, but there is definitely support or wealth being given. You guys will be receiving money. That's going to be the end of the hardship. There's going to be positive changes, repaying debt. Any bills that you have, if you're behind on your bills, you will be able to pay them. If your bills are due, you will be able to pay your bills on time. Whatever, you know, it, lunch, you know, somebody could buy you lunch. I feel like um, employment as well. Someone could be getting a job. Yeah, because this person was breadcrumbing you. Yeah, life path number six. Okay. Feeling enslaved to mentally ill partners or addicts. And it said a fucking don't pig. Space holding. Finding a way to care for yourself by taking care of others. Okay, I am on a mission. Someone missed that chance. Okay, time is money. And a motherfucker is wasting both time and money here. So, express gratitude for that shit. This dope head was a white girl. 656. Don't be an asshole about the situation. Just clear your energy. Someone could have became celibate here. Yeah, a plumber for the love of money. For the love of money. Gotta get that money, man. Gotta get that money, man. That could be... Someone could be a plumber, doesn't necessarily have to be. Someone may need a plumber and you're going to be able to get that fixed. Whatever fucking plumbing issues that you may have. Okay, someone could be a receptionist here. A retail worker. You guys take it however it resonates. Retail could be any retail store. All right, Spirit, give me clarity on this. And shit, it's motherfucking retail workers, it's motherfucking plumbers that's stoners, and it's motherfucking receptionists that's goddamn stoners. <laughs> What's going on for my stoners? 420 in this motherfucker. What's up? Yeah, I just seen a present. So definitely getting gifts. Some sort of gifts here. This could be money. This could be motherfucking weed. This could be literally, if it's, you know, like I said, as bad as, you know, like having to repay debt here, you're going to be able to do that. Look, baby, listen. Do you see this? Fruitful. Fruitful garden. No lacking. All right, honey. Let's see. Who was this message for? This is someone that is invested in some shit, okay? The feelings are mutual. Time is money. Don't waste either one. Don't waste your time worrying about money is what I just heard. Okay? Aquarius, Cancer. Y'all could be mentally fucked up about money. Just chill, okay? Spirit got you. Taurus. My motherfucking Taurus game. Bull game. Bull game. <laughs> okay, let's see. Who else? Somebody don't see this toxic shit. Or somebody don't understand. Okay. Okay. I'm getting like somebody don't understand the toxic shit that's going on. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. 
Okay, so look, I love your entire existence. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius is saying, I love your entire existence here. This is an Aries, Leo, Sagittarius masculine. A lack of clarity about something. About moving on. Somebody continuously like celebrating while someone else lacked clarity and is like ready to move on here. They don't know that they are fucking themselves up by continuously partying bullshit. Okay, whoever this person is that is ready to move on, but they lack clarity or there is confusion with this moving on here, you are the ones that spiritually discerned and protected. Yeah, look, a present is here. So you're getting... You're working with the high, you're working with someone to get clarity or to, to help you gain focus or some shit like that. Okay. Yeah. Healing, calm an impact here. So this is this person again, that's spiritually discerning. They're an impact. This marriage, this happiness, this home, calming the home, healing the home. Expressing gratitude for your home, for your marriage, for your children, for your, your goddamn dog. Because obviously somebody got a dog. My dog is going off. Oh, oh okay. Let's see. Who else is this message for? That's why my baby's coming in. Who is here? My son. My son is here. Yeah, I'm sure. The lover, an empress. So the mother, the yeah. wife, the lover, Gemini. Um, this could be, yeah, because we did have Gemini here, didn't we? Um, no, we didn't have Gemini here. Okay, so this could be a Gemini, or this is Taurus and Libra here. We definitely have Taurus out here. Someone could be a Taurus, heavy on the Taurus. Not just because I'm a Taurus, but because literally it's here. Um, No, come here. Let's see. I feel like someone could be giving you a present. Okay, be patient, growth, wisdom, and protection. That fell near Aquarius, Cancer, and Taurus, like around the top. So stand up, masculine, standing up. What else? Let's go ahead and end this so I can get into mommy boat now. Yeah, a lover standing up. A man standing up for his lover, something like that. Yeah, visions, investments, whatever this is. I told you that damn nine of pentacles, something that they have been investing in. Being brought to a balance. Libra energy, heavy on the Libra energy. Yeah, somebody is wanting to give up here. Let's get clarity on giving up. I feel like somebody is just ready to give up and just to bring things to balance, honestly. Um, let's see. Giving up. Because they feel like they have lost out on something. They have been lost and left out in the cold type shit. Yeah, a thief.
giving up their family. This is the Ten of Pentacles. Allowing someone else to come and steal that from them. Like what they have invested from them. 14th, Swissy. See? Not closing out this cycle. Aries, Virgo. Somebody's not closing out a cycle here. What is going on with this? A Libra or something? Look, justice before and after. The heart broke, the heartbreak you wasn't expecting, but this happiness for your spiritual growth, you damn sure better look forward to is what I'm hearing. Exactly just like that. <laughs> okay, justice. Told you. Online looking for information. So if you lack clarity on something, go look it up. Let's see, online looking for information. Yeah, sensitive on how to get money. So you could be online looking up ways to manifest money. To overcome your trials and your tribulations. Or online trying to look up some sort of information here. Someone could be online looking up information on rebelling, okay? What to do when your partner rebels because a foolish man listens to his heart versus showing respect and communicating, even if they're in a new environment, but instead someone is, okay, an Aquarius is running here, running to a new environment. Okay, this Virgo is a female gathering their emotions. So someone's like unable to gather their emotions. Or this is someone's child. Let's see. Let's get clarity on this run fast. Someone ran to a new environment. Okay, so maybe somebody feel like someone moved on too fast. And they're just giving up on it. And they feel left out. An imbalance here. If you guys are dealing with a Sagittarius, run. <laughs> There's an imbalance here. The run. Yeah. There was like somebody did not want to work together. They would rather take the fuck off instead. They were determined to run. Okay, a new environment. New environment. Release your fears to go to a new environment. That's what someone could be talking to you about. Okay, Aquarius. Someone could have moved to a different state. Aquarius. Aquarius is not talking. They're just running. <laughs> They're just leaving to get their emotions together.
Aquarius. If you want affection, then ask for it. What? A new environment to make money. So somebody could be getting a job offer somewhere else. There's some good news coming. Okay, I don't know. Be happy. If you're feeling tied down and bogged down by shit, like, literally, be happy about this shit. It is money coming. Like, money coming, money coming, money coming. All in this motherfucker is money. It's no secrets. You're attracting this. You're not left out. This is your birthright. You're getting this gift. Okay. Let's see what's going on here. For my stunners. Your life purpose is to bring divine light to the world. Love and light. Healing love and light to this world. treasure chest again abundance is coming make that wish the wave of prosperity is right behind that wish all you got to do is speak on it and it's yours the universal manager has the ability to bring everyone a va a vibrational match to what they are giving their attention to without depriving anyone else from what it is that they are wanting the universe is big enough to fulfill everyone's flow okay Dream big. Let go of the small thoughts about yourself and see yourself succeeding. Oh, how wonderful you are. As you get high as a motherfucking guide. <laughs> We are wanting to awaken within you your memory of how wonderful you are, how good you are, and how worthy of whatever it is that you are wanting. Okay? It is all within your reach. I want to get high, 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 high. I don't know. Arthur, there's a book inside of you that wishes to be expressed. Make the time to write it. You guys could journal just like me. I have hella books over here. My kids are like, God, mama, if anything ever happens to you, I'm just going to read your books. Okay, that's fine. I got plenty of them. <coughs> <coughs> so, anyways, I don't know. That was just a side message. Neither here nor that long. What's going on for my stunners? A seagull. Why the fuck do I keep saying seagulls? Six oh six could be very significant. Somebody could be seeing that. I know I just said I was done with this damn reading. <laughs> Who cares when I got on their phone? Kilt. Return. Kickboxing. Lady and the Tramp. So that movie, The Lady and the Tramp, could be very significant. Kickboxing. Someone could be watching kickboxing. Thermometer, someone could be returning something to a store. A mechanic. 
Somebody could be wanting to kickbox their mechanic. No, I'm joking. <laughs> Shut the fuck up. Someone could be a mechanic. Okay. Show cheapskates. Smoke on the water. Smoke. We say this is a stoner. Okay. Smoke on the water. Somebody smoking on the beach. Somebody need to go and like really take a load the fuck off here. Someone is a mechanic. Someone could be buying something, showing it to you, and then returning it. Because they ain't really got it like that. Shut up. Why the fuck plumber is here again? Snorkel. So somebody definitely going to the fucking beach here. And cuddling, bundle of joy. Oh shit, a baby. So somebody got a baby. King Kong ain't got nothing on me. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit. <laughs> I've played too fucking much. <laughs> Way too motherfucking much. <laughs> okay, thank you. A mansion? Dream big. Y'all, oh, I just heard you not dreaming rich enough for me. <laughs> If you want that motherfucking mansion, vision that motherfucking mansion, okay? Guitarist, someone could be playing a guitar here. Someone could be marrying someone that is a guitarist. Or that is a mechanic or a plumber. Or a kickboxer. Hungry. Your baby could be hungry. I know I got to go feed my fucking kids too. <laughs> Sherlock Holmes. That's solving mysteries, isn't it? I don't know about these folks, y'all. I ain't even gonna lie. Cheapskate. Yeah, somebody buying some shit and they'll show it and then they'll fucking return it because they're cheapskate. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> oh, of course, thanks. Why would you try to flex on someone? Lettuce. Someone could be um, making lettuce in their garden, adding lettuce to their garden. Rolling stone. I be rolling, rolling. Rolling down the river. <laughs> Bugs Bunny and Daphne. Um, home relaxing in your motherfucking mansion. Period. Eating on lettuce like a motherfucking bunny. Period. Who? Cuddling with your baby. That's what I see for you and your motherfucking future. Period. In your motherfucking panties. Because I know I've seen panties out here. Panty. Let me see what the fuck going on with these panties. Because that's just weird. Panties. What's going on with panties? That nigga got caught. Okay. Aries Leo Sagittarius masculine. You could have given this masculine your panties. This is a woman's panties. 
that um, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, masculine could have got, like, you realize this woman pen, like, you realize this person was losing out on money with 555 on the clock because of finding this woman panties. Somebody could have found some shit. You guys could sell panties. No. Look. The seagull is a spirit animal. Look up what a seagull means. Listen, Daddy, go get um Yeah, cause look. That's what this imbalance is. Hold on, because I can look this up. Undress the motherfucking drops. Even the score, what I said with that Libra falling before and after I said that she was about to be brought to a justice. The X game. Okay. I don't know what all that meant, but you saying it. Let me see. What a seagull mean. Listen, baby, this says the seagull adaptable. Seeing a seagull represents adaptability. And what did I say? Resourceful as well as opportunities and favorable circumstances indicates focus on the need to find ways to survive even during uncomfortable what doing even uncomfortable just to succeed open-mindedness the ability to provide for oneself baby what did i say let's get it they're marrying of the sea. So the sea could be very fucking significant in this marriage here. It represents a union. And it also represents the interrelationship between your mind, body, and your spirit. Wow. Okay, so someone could have done something uncomfortable just to succeed. That's what it's saying. Okay, okay, okay. Learn to see things from a higher perspective. They hide, They fly higher than other animals. You will find peace when you're going through difficult times. The universe is sending you signs. It is time to fulfill your destiny. It can also be a spiritual charge and motivation. Learn to be independent. Diversity, freedom, arising your self esteem results in good outcome. It guides you to look at things from a different angle. Parenthood and guidance. That is the seagull totem meaning. Involves teaching and guiding the future of others. Wisdom, experience, and mentorship. So make sure you're not just doing anything for money. Um, yeah. Don't do just any and everything for money, honey, because mm -mm, that's tacky. Anyways, my loves, I'm going to leave it here. Thank you, guys. Mm -hmm. Love you.
Peace.